hello friends welcome to a new video in my channel so today we are going to learn how to create a county function in smartsheet let's get started we are going to learn today how to find uh, duplicate values in a column using county function because as most of you know we in excel sheet you have an option called uh, conditional formatting wherein you you have uh, it's a straightforward option you go directly to the conditional formatting and you have an option called uh, duplicate values right so uh, in in smart sheet you don't have such kind of uh, similar uh, you don't have similar kind of options in smart sheet even though you have a conditional formatting as you can see in my screen right now that you cannot uh, create something like you know uh, duplicate this value uh, if it is uh, uh, repeating so on so there is no such options but for that what we are going to do now here all right let's say in primary column i am just going to rename as invoice number all right i am going to enter some random invoice numbers for example let's say anything All right so in in our first column we have uh, some invoice numbers okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to create a helper using county function this is helper so uh, the county function syntax is same as uh, county function in excel as well we can see that uh, in a minute uh, so if i click equals count if okay you will get a format i mean syntax as range comma the criterion or a criteria you can say so for my range is uh, invoice column is my range so to do that in 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 yeah, the, the format to select the entire column is to inside closed bra uh, square bracket i'm sorry about that inside square bracket you need to type the column name all right then full colon do the same again invoice number all right you can see uh, uh, the column is being detected completely okay then comma you select the row that you want to uh, check whether this particular item is being repeated in the column or not so this is the uh, value that i want to check if this is repeated in my entire invoice column okay so i'm going to select that then close bracket hit enter okay you can see now that uh, invoice number 81254868 is not uh, duplicated or uh, uh, yeah it's not repeated anywhere in this column if it was repeated the count if function will show the value as 2 right uh, to test that again let me copy this and i'm pasting it in a new row you can see my number changes here right so if i'm adding it again it is changing correct so which means uh, i have this particular invoice more than one time in my entire row which says it's a duplicate in in short you guys know it very well right so i'm going to uh, just convert the column formula into the entire uh, helper columns okay i want to test again for another uh, invoice number let's say i want to copy this i'm going to add it over here you can see that the count became uh, i mean the count changed for this uh, invoice correct now comes the uh, condition formatting uh, section yeah so i want to highlight uh, the invoice numbers which are duplicated same as uh, excel so to do that what i'm going to do i'm going to go to condition formatting here add a new rule set my condition if my help helper I want to define a custom uh, criteria if my helper is greater than one which is a common logic for everyone if it is greater than one then I want this format like I want to highlight that row you can see already it is changed okay highlight that row in this uh, color or this format yeah uh, and you have an another option if helper is greater than one then apply this format to the entire row if you want you want to do uh, if you want to do the format to the entire row you can do that or you can change to only the invoice column yeah 
If I do that, you can see the uh, the backend format gone and it only reflects in the invoice gone. All right. Now let's do it again. I'm going to add a new invoice number. I mean, uh, duplicate invoice number again. So you can see it got highlighted by default. So in in uh, this way, the user will be knowing that you know this now the invoice number that I entered into the column is uh, duplicated. I hope you enjoy this video and like this video and appreciate if you can subscribe my uh, channel so that I can give you more tips and tricks like this from Smartsheet, Excel, Power BI, whatsoever. You can comment on my video as well what, what is the next uh, subject that you want to learn. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.